Hi there, this is David and welcome back to Let's Play Ease for the Mask of the Sun. Last time we got a couple of things going on here. We rescued Gilbon's wife by getting the Salsetta flower. We also ran into Dr. Flair, who decided to stay here because his luck would have it. There's an opening for a doctor in this village. We also heard that there is um demons on the loose over in Asteria. So, yeah. We have to go on over there because Everyone's in danger! In regards to the Eye of the Sun and the Eye of the Earth that we have received, we also found out that we need that there are three eyes in total, and we need all three of them in order to meet with this sage that's here. It's just some arbitrary number. Pretty much we need three MacGuffins, and we can see the sage. And we already have two, so just one more. And, you know... The eye is over here in Asteria, so that's nice. Meanwhile, was it Golbez and Rosa and Kane plotting? No! It's these other four people plotting. Oh. Okay. Um, he was pretty much on Death's doorstep. I'm kind of surprised that they didn't actually kill him off, you know, once and for all. Oh, yikes. Oh, uh, Lisa, what are you doing here? Were you eavesdropping this whole time? Oh. You probably shouldn't be here right now. If Aryo would run in on, uh, you know, the, the evil people planning their world destruction and all that kind of stuff. <laughs> Just saying, whoa! Oh wow, so Eldil doesn't even want to hear her either. Oh shit, this isn't going to end well. Uh-oh. Seriously? They're going to kill Lisa? This didn't happen in Dawn of Ease. What in the world? Ah! with her head. Wow. That was unexpected. What's going on now? Are you reviving her? Whoa. Wait, did you like put your soul inside of Lisa's body? Did you sacrifice yourself to revive her? What exactly just happened right there? Oh, you used the necklace to bring her back. Okay. Maybe he used the necklace to bring her back and then he just teleported away? It looked to me like... Like she swallowed his soul or something. Like, what in the world just happened there? Huh. Oh. Well, that's because there's demons running amok all throughout Asteria. Yeah. Yikes! Look at this! Yeah, but thankfully we're high enough levels that we can deal with them. If you try to go inside of any of these uh, houses, the majority of them are locked. Some of them are open, like the weapon shops and the armor shops. I don't know why. It, okay, it's been two years. They have to earn a livelihood somehow. And they're still standing behind their counters, like, seriously? Change your shop into something else. If, you know, weapons and armor doesn't work, change it to, to I don't know, item shops or a, a farm stand or something. Anyway, this hospital is open. If you need to buy an herb and you're lower levels than I am, I would highly recommend having one at all times, but especially for the upcoming boss fight. Hey there, talk to me! Yeah, you're so useful. Ugh, I don't even know why I tried to talk to you. What? I don't know, it is kind of a mystery, I've got to say. Uh, yep, that'd be the one. Oh. Oh! Rahahahili! <laughs> oh, he sells stolen goods? Huh. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. You guys have anything 
useful to say at all, or do you all just repeat the same crap over and over and over again? Yeah, no. Nothing useful at all! Great. Just great. So I'm not gonna spend too much time hanging around, uh, Minia, yeah, because everything's closed anyway. I wanna get on out of here, and, uh, we have now seen silver armored people, and over here there's gold armored people. So you know what that means? It's time to level up! I am currently at level 17, but these enemies give really good experience, and, um, you can grind on them up to about level 20, and I would highly recommend doing so. So that's what I'm going to do, um, and definitely do it now because this grinding opportunity will not last long. This is a prime grinding opportunity, and you definitely do want to get it done now. Oh, a demonic presence. Yikes! So let me get my grinding all done. Okay, I got that taken care of. I'm now level 20. So, yeah, let's go deal with that demonic presence now, which is right over here. Uh-oh. Uh, you're taking my line there. The one and only, of course. And you must be that knight that Eldil sent here. The woman who has the eye of the moon. Is that Lilia? Hmm. Yikes. And this guy can be rather hard. You can only hurt him whenever he's rearing up for his attack right there. Whenever he's rearing up to like charge you. So whenever he's charging, you're going to want to charge him. Um, and avoid those two little blobs because they will just kind of push you out of the way and damage you. Uh, they make it so it's even harder to strike the knight. Also, try to avoid all the spears coming out of the walls, but that's easier said than done. Those spears are really obnoxious. Come on, we are up to charge. Yeah, you could try to stand up, um, but honestly, he doesn't really, like, rear up to charge. If you're up there, he really only charges whenever you're down below, so that kind of sucks. It's just kind of like trying to get yourself Urgh! in position to, uh to kill him. It just takes a minute because the damn slimes on frickin' things flying all over the place. Oh, it's so annoying. Oh my god, I hate this boss. Die! Once you deal enough damage, he will go into a second form, which hopefully, right now... Okay, once he's in his second form, you can just kind of wail on him and kill him. Do avoid those little blue um, orbs, though, because they will shoot out lightning, which is instant death. No matter how high leveled you are or how much HP you are, if you get hit by those blue lightnings, you will die. It's horrible. Okay, yeah. So we have freed the uh, ease of the demonic presence and all that kind of stuff, and the rota tree sleeps. The other rota tree says the exact same thing. Over here, we can see the entrance to the abandoned mine, but we can't actually get into it, because they have cut off all extraneous things in this version of the game. You can't really explore Asteria like you could uh, explore it back in Dawn of Ease. They really cut this place down a lot. We're not going to be going through any kind of temples, not going to be going through the mines, not going to be going through Darm Tower. None of that! Yeah. Like I said, this is a much worse version of Ease 4, even though it is canonical. No, I haven't. Oh. Well, now there aren't. Oh. Huh, he's in the Solomon Shrine. Really? Okay. Well, we'll have to keep that in mind for later as well. Yeah, and the demons keep on coming back. I guess so, even though, like I said, the demons keep coming. I don't know how great that is, but sure, whatever. Oh. Oh, well, where is he now? Oh, really? Huh. Okay. Well, we'll have to check that out, the, uh, the thieves hideout and all that kind of stuff, which I guess is a storehouse now. Hey there. Yeah. You know, 
if Minia was overrun and Minia has a wall around it, how come this place wasn't overrun? I, I mean, there's nothing really guarding this area either. Did I already talk to this guy? I don't remember if I did or not. Anyway, yeah. So that's it for Zeptic Village. Yeah, really small, not much going on here. So what we need to do now is try to head towards Rance Village. Not Lance, but Rance in this game. Oh, hey there. Oh. They weren't sealed off in Dawn of Ease! Come on now! Cheap asses. Yeah. Oh. Okay. So yeah, we can't go inside of there. That kind of sucks, but whatever. Yeah, I I'm really shocked at how much content they just completely cut out of this game. It's pretty ridiculous. This must be Gobin's warehouse. Well, I'm gonna go inside anyway. Let's see. Ooh! Oh, yeah, I guess so. Um, can we open up this treasure? Oh, I guess not. What's this? Oh, uh, nothing! So, yeah. Um, there's really no point to go there right now except for that special little scene that we got there where Adol just comments on it. So let's just continue on our way. Hey there. Oh. Well, thanks. I don't know who you are, but thanks. Hey. Oh, hey, Keith. Really? Huh, that's kind of cool. Sure. Uh, hey, nice. So you get the ultra magic. We don't really get any magic like that in this game. We got tons of magic in Dawn of Ease. We even got rings in Dawn of Ease, but nothing like that here. Just magical swords. Yeah. And that magical swords are only useful for a very small window of time, but sure. Great game. Great. Well, you were used to it. There was nothing else to do, you know? Hey there. Oh. Huh. I want to say Benoa is her mother. I'm pretty sure. I don't know. It hasn't been that long since I've played the game, but I don't remember who she is. <laughs> Everybody loves doing their little ballerina twir uh, twirls in this game. Hey there. Really? Seriously? Yeah. You guys should probably open up a different business. I don't know how you're still in business, but whatever. Hey there. Okay, so some other crap that I don't care about. If you used your herb in the previous boss fight, buy a new one. I didn't, so I don't have to. Let's just move on with life. Hey there. Yeah, he did. Yeah. Not that you guys need it, but hey, it's there. Anyway, let's go inside of Lilia's house. Wow, no important people are home. Anywhere. Huh. That sucks. Uh, hey, person. Who's there? Who's saying all this? Tarf. I don't remember Tarf either. Who is Tarf? I don't know. Your guess is as good as mine. And who are you? Oh, okay, you're Luda. Got you. Weren't you studying inside the shrine or something? Oh, yeah. Really? You don't say. Fina and Leia? Try Leia. What is this? Like, seriously? Layer? This is a fan translation. You would think that they would have used, you know, the names that were in every other Ease game. Yeah. Oh! Then what is it modeled after? It's modeled after the self sentence Huh. Oh, well, maybe, I guess so. Well, I mean, that eye is here for some reason. 
Well, what's that? Well, what did it say? Really? Okay. Yeah. How convenient for us. The one thing that we came here for is the one thing that you tell us about. Okay, so where is it? Oh. Huh. Yeah, but where? Oh, but she's not at home. Yeah, grave danger. Great, you're completely useless. Well, too bad I can't find them either. Uh, well, that sucks. But can we find Lilia in the Eye of the Moon? Find out next time. Let's play Ease 4 Mask of the Sun. This has been David. If you like this, please like, comment, and subscribe. And have a good day.